everyone, how's it going? For today's project, I'm going to show you guys how to draw a simple little turkey line design project. Now, some materials you're going to need are a piece of paper, something to draw with like a pencil or a marker. I would recommend pencil for you. I'm using marker just to help you guys see it a little better. Something to color with like markers, color pencils, crayons, even paint if you have some. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to start by making a head of a turkey and I want it to be kind of like a side view. So I'm going to start right here and I'm just going to draw a line that's just going to curve around like this. Then starting here I'm going to draw a line that's just going to go out and then in. And then I'm going to do the same thing right here. I want to make the beak for the turkey. So to do this, we're just going to draw a little line that goes down and then it comes back here. And then I like to add a little line in there for the mouth. I'm also going to add a little line that goes down and curves up for like that little gobble of the turkey. And then we want to make an eye. I'm just going to keep this eye simple and I'm going to make a circle with a smaller one inside. And then I'm just going to color in the rest of it. Now starting here, I want to make the body of the turkey. So I'm going to start here on the neck and I'm going to make a nice round body. So we're just going to curve around. We're going to come up to here. The next step is to draw the feet. So I'm going to start here and I'm going to draw two lines going down and then two lines going down over here. We'll make some toes, little lines that go out and up, down and up, and then down and up here. Do the same thing here, down and up, down and up, down and up. Now, the next step is we want to make the tail of the turkey. So I'm going to draw a line that's just going to go straight out here. And if you want to use a ruler or a piece of paper to kind of help you make a straight line, that's totally fine. But I'm just going to make a nice straight line across. So I'm going to draw a line across. I'm going to jump over and continue it to here. And you can see I didn't go all the way to the edge. I left some space. Now our next step is we're going to start from here and we're going to draw a big sad face that goes up and then down to here. So to do this we're going to start right here and I'm going to draw a line It's going to curve up. It's going to come down right to here. Now I want to make some lines that go down to my turkey. If you want to, you can always put a little dot right here and use a ruler and kind of line up some lines. I'm just going to freehand this right now. And I'm just going to make some lines that go right down towards my turkey. I'm going to have to kind of jump over some areas. And I'm just going to draw some lines. They're all going to angle down towards the turkey. And I'm going to try my best to keep the same amount of lines on each side. Now, you can always add some extra details in here too. You can always add some little curved lines on here with some extra little lines in here for like the wings of the turkey. Now, our next step is we want to come in here and we want to add lots of different designs and details in here. So we want to use lots of lines and we have lots of nice space in here to use the to make them up. So lines come in all sorts of different shapes and sizes. You can do things like diagonal lines. You could do zigzag lines in here. Wavy lines. You could make spiral lines. All around here. There's so many different types of lines you can make. So what I want you to do is I want you to fill up all of your turkey feathers with a different type of line pattern. Don't use the exact same one in each one. Do a bunch of different ones in each one.
Okay, once you're done with this, then you have this really awesome looking turkey with all these different designs on here, lots of different line designs. Now the next step for you is to color your turkey. Now when you color it, you can color this however you want to. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stick with just a plain brown for my turkey. I think I'm just gonna use some crayons. Then I want the back of the feathers to really pop, so I'm gonna use markers. And instead of just doing like one color in each one, I wanna do some patterns. So try to use at least two colors in each one of your little turkey feathers back here. So I'm gonna go ahead and fast forward and color this. And there you go, there is your line art design turkey project. You can see that these colors back here really make it pop out. You could always go and color in your turkey with marker too. I just did some crayon just because I wanted it to kind of look a little bit different. But overall it turns out really cool and if you really take your time and get all those white spots, it'll look really, really nice. So thanks for watching this video and I hope you guys enjoyed it.